Hi everybody, George Chamberlain here watching your dollars on this Monday morning, the 22nd of October. We've got a busy week coming up. Let me preview it for you real quick here. Um, we have a two-day meeting of the Federal Reserve Board starting tomorrow and then at 11.15 Pacific Time on Wednesday, we'll get the announcement from the Fed. You know, with the election, when they make that announcement, the election will be less than two weeks away. They're not about to do anything dramatic, but you never know. Bernanke is pretty independent, more independent than a lot of other uh, Fed chairmen have been, so we'll watch and see what happens. I think it's going to be interesting to see what happens with uh, the announcements from a couple of tech companies that will be uh, will be unveiling new products. Uh, tomorrow, Tuesday, we have a meeting up in the Bay Area that uh, Apple has called. They haven't explained the purpose of the meeting, but the betting money says that they'll introduce their new iPad Mini, a smaller version of the uh, the traditional iPad, this to compete with the, the Nook and the Kindle and some of the other devices, the e-readers that are out there, and it will be at a much lower price than the iPad, so I think there'll be some interest there. And then on Friday, Microsoft rolls out its, uh, its report, and, and it will be introducing Windows 8, the new operating system, and also showing how it will be used in devices for different uh, uh, types of tablet devices and smartphones. That's, uh, that's something that a lot of people are, are concerned about. The early reviews of Windows 8 have not been all that great, although some of the ones I've seen have been pretty positive. So we we'll kind of have watched that. A couple other economic reports rolling out, but those should be the highlights for this, uh, this coming week. Watching your dollars, I'm George Chamberlain. Have a good one.